Hi guys, thanks for joining me today. Today I'm going to be showing you kind of how I organize my VB pen case, set up my VB pen case, that type of thing. So this is the VB pen case. It is this really pretty black glittery material and you have some rose gold foil and rose gold hardware on the zipper here and up here on the logo and you have this cute little charm. So let's just open it up. This is what it looks like. You have pen cases here or pen sleeve, pen loops here and pen loops here. And you have some, you have three pockets on this flap on the side and then you have one big pocket on this flap. Now I don't have the biggest pen collection or VB pen collection. So I'm, I'm a relatively kind of a newbie when it comes to collecting the VB pens. So I'm pretty sure I can fit my entire collection on this side. So, I don't know what I'm going to put back here just yet, but I have some ideas. So, I guess let's just get started. I have all of my pins over here to the side, and we're just going to start filling it up. I don't really have um, any particular order that I'm putting these in. Now, if you have like a larger collection, you could, you know, do the rainbow, you could do like color groups, that type of thing. So, but I'm just going to put them in here. I do want to try to keep the pastel colors together, though. One thing I am super excited about this for is because my daughters actually refer to these as princess pins, and they try to grab them all the time, and uh, I'm glad I can put them in here and close it up and take it with me, or close it up and put it on a shelf and keep out of the reach of little grabby hands. They actually call um, this one Cinderella and this one Tiana and they try to grab them all the time. It's so I'm glad they're my pins will have like a safe little home now if that makes sense. I do want the little logo on the front though just because I think that looks really nice. Okay so let's put this one there almost done yeah see I think I'm gonna actually have just the right amount to fill up this front page of the case yeah there's one left right there so and I can put the September kit pin in here when it gets here so that's what it looks like as of now I really like it it's really cute I'm excited so okay as for this part, um, it comes with a cleaning cloth and it comes with the VB, um, the pin list. I have a few things I wanna try and put in here. So I guess let's get started. I have these dainty stickers. They're actually stickers for your pins. So I don't wanna just put them down in there cause I don't want them to slide all the way down to the bottom and not see them. So I'm gonna try to put this journaling card at the back here to see if they'll kinda stay right up front and center. I have some journaling cards and stuff. This one just says pretty pins. And then this one is actually the little VB calendar that I made. So I'm gonna put it right in here so I can keep up with all of that in one place. And that one's just because it says pretty pins and I feel like it kind of belongs in here a little bit. Next, I actually, I have this, my pen sleeve and some ink refills. I want to put my pen sleeve in here because you know I could just put my pen sleeve in here and then I could grab a couple of pens throw them in here and then put this in my planner bag or my purse and be ready to go but I don't know if it's gonna fit or not but I also want to put ink refills in here so I'm gonna try to put a few ink refills in my pen sleeve so it's gonna be like a double pocket you guys will see what I'm talking about in just a minute Okay, so the pen sleeve has the ink refills in it, and I want to try to see if my pen sleeve will fit down in here. And it does, yes. Now, mine has this little charm I put on there. I'm going to try to tuck it down in here so it doesn't clank around or hit up against the pins or cause scratches or any of that stuff. So I want to make sure it's nice and tucked in there. And I th think that's going to work. Okay, so I have my cleaning cloth back here. Like I said, I don't have enough pins to fill this up. So I'm trying to think of what I could put back here. So 
I think I'm just gonna put a piece of paper in here just to kind of change it up a little bit. I'm gonna put my cloth back down in here. You could put like an adhesive pocket back here if you wanted to, or some cute clips and stuff like that. Okay, so here is my pin list, and then this is the little slim folder. I kept these stickers because they have the little pins for the pin list. So I kind of want to keep those together. I'm thinking, I'm thinking I just want to put this in the slim folder and kind of tuck it back here a little bit like that. Let's see if everything's going to work out. Yes. Okay. Sweet. So um, that's how I'm going to set up my pin case. I really like it. Really kind of short, sweet to the point. I got my pins over here. I have my pin stickers, my pin sleeve, ink refills, uh, VB calendar, and just some pretty pins. And then I have my cleaning cloth, my pin list, and my pin stickers back here. Now, uh, you know, once my collection grows a little bit and I get room for pins back here, I'm just take, probably just going to take this out or something. So might rework the pockets a little bit so the pin list can stay in here with the pins. So that is my VB pin case. If you guys want to stay up to date on all things uh, Villa Beautiful, when she's going to be or if she's going to be re-releasing or anything like that, anything new coming up, be sure you are following her on Instagram and the Facebook group and you guys are subscribed to the newsletter so you guys can stay up to date on all that info and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.